Hi everybody, welcome to part two of my Goodwill blue box jewelry unboxing. Okay, was a mouthful. Okay, I made me some coffee. You know, this is not that bad of a box. I've had some that were just horrendous. Like I said, okay, this is a beauty. Oh my goodness. Look at the inside of this. Look at the inside of the bow. Wow. Look at that. There is no maker mark. But you can tell it's an older piece. I'm surprised it's not all scratched up being in that box. Isn't that beautiful? You put six on that. That's gorgeous. Okay, this is an F as in Frank. It is a clamper and it's very pretty. I think somebody made this. I think this is starting to come apart right there. Yep. This is really pretty. Wow. Well, that's a bummer. Isn't that pretty? It's starting to come apart right there. So this will go into crafts. Wow. Okay. So we've got I'll do a bangle lot. I got some bangles. Make sure they're all. Um, ta da! Ta da! Okay. So we'll do a lot. Let me put these over here. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, beautiful. Huh. Okay, the underside of this is, has got a little bit of wear. And this ring there doesn't even need to be. I think that's where they were hanging it somewhere. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a funny little triangle. They might have been hanging it to store it. That's not necessary to be on there. This has a, lot, uh, a fold over plus. Yeah, a security chain here. Um, what I'm there is a little bit of wear on the back here, but otherwise it's in great condition. It looks great. This little scarabs, I don't think they're anything but plastic, but it's just darling. It just feels kind of rough. Yeah, that's really cute. So we just put five on it. I don't think. Like I said, I don't think those are real stones. I think those are plastic. But still, it's cool because it's vintage. It's got the fold over and the nice chain. So we'll do that. That's cute. Hmm. Well, this is interesting. This is a Y necklace. It's very different. Hmm. This has got a really nice extender on it. There is no maker mark. It's kind of interesting. What do you guys think? That's the Y, and that comes down, and you've got the bigger um, silver. Yeah, this is cool. Show it to you. And that's the Y part there beautiful little crystal bead there the crystals here the brown here so it's very well thought out the faux pearls are real pretty yeah I don't see any markings but this is real pretty so let's put six on this just because it's very unusual yeah the like I said they're faux pearls faux pearls then we've got this pretty colored almost that agate, kind of a brownish tan agate color here. Then you've got the crystal here. And then this beautiful little um, rhinestone ball there. And the silver tone is great. I like that. Very interesting. Oh, we've got a beautiful brooch. Wow. This is golden rhinestone. This is 
not got a maker's mark, I don't think. Let me check. Let me sip coffee. Ah, oh, that's good. Good stuff. Okay, no, I don't see a maker. It should be right up there, but there's nothing. But this is really, really pretty. This is like a darker champagne gold. Those are gorgeous. This is real pretty, so I'll put six on that. Wow, very nice. Okay, I've got an ear, another earring. That's kind of cool. We've got another one of those leather dollar in crafts. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, this is one of the old style foldovers that my mother used to let me play with. That's going to go in crafts just because it's a little bit faded through there, but it sure is cute. And if anybody wants it, it'd be a dollar. Now, this is cool. Hold on here. Okay. This has a... This is neat. This is a barrel clasp. This looks very oriental. Even the clasp looks oriental. It's a barrel. Um, what we've got here... There we go. Is... You start there and then it comes down and you've got just some white beads and some brown beads they feel kind of wooden and then you've got a little plastic piece there with a flower and look at this this is like origami oh, that is so cool it's paper that is paper that is so freaking cool. Hold on. Okay. I'm going to put it like this. Look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I just love it. So I'm going to put five on it just because I know it's old. That is so neat. I like unusual pieces. Oh, this is pretty. It's a very nice gold tone. We do have a Maker Mark. It's Talbot's. The big T. This is real pretty. You've got little gold tone, little spheres, little round circles, and you've got some more of these little faceted. These faceted ones, the clear ones are plastic, but I think that's just kind of weight wise. These are kind of heavy. This is gorgeous. Sounds good too. Isn't that neat? And the little circles up at the top. Oh, this is pretty. Very, very, very nice. The gold tone's nice. There's the T for Talbots. So I'll put seven on that. That's just gorgeous. Love it. Okay, next we have something that we should have had yesterday. It is a beautiful green color. And this is another Talbot. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. What do y'all think? Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, come on. So every last one of you has to turn over? Okay. Okay. It's okay. We'll do it. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ta -da! Oh, I like that. This is beautiful. This, like I said, this would have been perfect for yesterday. You could have gone on a leprechaun hunt with this on. I love green. Green and gold. It's beautiful. Let's put six on that one. Just beautiful. Okay, next is... I think this one's loft. It's the little diamond in the circle. And on the back it says China, but I think it's loft. Pretty sure. Okay, turn it around and it's really pretty. You guys, this is pretty. Look at that. 
frosted gold tone. This is a very nice here. The lobster claw. It's got a nice extender. It is extended. Look at that. So let's put five on that one. That's gorgeous. Wow, I like that. Look at that. Perfect condition, guys. Perfect condition. Yeah, that kind of freaks me out because you would just think that stuff would just be beat. All the you know what -y. Let me check for rhinestones here real quick. Is that one missing? No. Let me see if there's a maker mark. I don't see one. This is really pretty. It's a little rhinestone, just a gold tone bangle. I don't see any missing so far. My eyeballs are going to fall out of my head. Hold on here. <gasps> yeah, I found one. Dang it. Arrgh! There's just one missing. Nope, there's two missing. Okay, anyway, this is gorgeous. There's only a couple missing, and I think they're on the part that someone was whacking down, you know. I don't know if you can see it. It's right there in there. So what we'll do with uh, the couple missing stones, I'm going to put $2 on it because it's really, really pretty. Just for the heck of it. And if it doesn't sell, it will go, eventually it will go into crafts. Now look at this beauty. Gosh, I hope I have the other one. Look at that. Um, that is a Rivoli. Wow. Oh my gosh. I don't think that's a real pearl though. Yeah. But boy, is that pretty. That's the only thing about these lots. These blue boxes, you just don't find the matches to the earring. This is gorgeous. I don't know who made this. This has a little diamond up here with the lobster. This is so pretty. This is gold tone and then this is silver tone with someone's initials. The initials are S J J F J A S. Joan, let's see, what could that be for? Let's see, J something, J-A-S. I think I'll save this for my friend. Those are her initials, or super close. But look at this, this is so pretty. And this actually comes off, but look at that. Isn't that pretty? And then that just kind of comes off. That is pretty. I'll give that to her. I think she would like that. And I don't think it's anything precious metal or anything. It's just got a really nice lobster on it. No, I don't think so. Nope, just a nice lobster. Make sure she gets that. That's gorgeous. Those initials are so wild. They're so close. Oh, it's a turtle. This is so cute. Oh, you guys, look at that. Eh, it's like a jelly belly. Oh my God. Okay, turtle lovers. It's on a nice little, just kind of a, eh. I don't think it's leather. I can't tell, but it's on a nice cord. Let's do four on him. He is super cute. Super, super cute. He's got little eyeballs that stick up. Ah, I love that. That matches that ring I have. Let me show you. That is funny. There's the ring. And here he is. <laughs> That's so cute. Look at that. So if anybody's interested in these as a set, a pair, 
This ring is about an eight and a half. Let me measure it real quick. It might be a nine. I cannot remember. It is, no, I was right. Eight and three quarters. And then you've got this. So for the ring and the turtle, we'll put $17. This is not sterling, but this is a gorgeous ring. Okay. And just for the turtle, I think I said, what did I say, four or five? So just for the turtle, we'll do five, and for both of them, we'll add $12 for the ring. So we'll do 17 for both. Okay? Very nice. That is cute. I can't believe we're finding such nice stuff. Okay, this is J. Crew. This is too bad. This is um, really pretty. It does have a little scratch on it, and I have a feeling that's a little dirty. But yeah, that's J. Crew. So it goes into crafting. Okay, here we go. Here is another nice little charmy type of bracelet. So we have just the little coins, the kind of shiny frosted coins on one side and this has a mark this is I don't know that mark hold on this is oh American Eagle <laughs> and it's got these cute little um, plastic faceted beads very good condition so we'll put three dollars on that AEO Isn't that cool Oh, these are precious. These are just little bitty. These are freebies. If anybody buys anything, I don't like to sell this kind of stuff. I'd rather give this away. If you buy anything, they are just little um, kind of a thicker thread, almost a leather thread. There's a cross on the front, and on the back it says he lives. This is perfect for Easter. You guys know the minute you you pay, I ship out within the day. But these are precious. So if you buy something and you request, just request one if you don't mind. So if two people buy something and they want these, they will go into their bag. Aren't those neat? I love stuff like that because I, I feel like it's there for a reason. Isn't that something? I find all kinds of stuff like that. Just like the Joan, my friend Joan, that, those are her initials, you know, it's just, just crazy, crazy, crazy. I wonder if this is sterling, I don't think so. And of course we're not, oh, that's beautiful. That's almost like a Labradorite. Yeah, isn't that pretty? And like I said, of course we're not going to find it. Oh, 70s called again. Somebody tripped and fell and lost their earring. Pretty. I like that, though. It's like a tan color. And these are not clips. These are pierced. I would wear these. Yes, I would. Aren't those cute? And then these are like the 80s disco. Somebody went to the disco, fell off their platform shoes and lost an earring. Okay, get another pile. I know you guys think I'm just kind of poo. Okay, what in the world? This is an earring. <laughs> this is wild. Okay. Mm. This is beautiful. Look at those. Look at the little rhinestones. There's nothing on the back. It's a clip. Man, somebody was fancy with these. You've got the faux pearls. It's got the little stone look in the back and these beautiful rhinestones. Man, that's pretty. Okay. Oh, I've got some more bangles. Some of these are real cute. Okay, let's get all the bangles. All the bangles. Okay. 
guys, we're almost done. How fun. This has been a good box. Okay. Those are go into the bangle bunch. So that's all of these. And that. Hmm. I don't think so. I don't see anything. Doesn't even sound right. If anything was going to be sterling, you would think it was that one. This one is super cute. This goes right along with the little butterflies. Isn't that cute? And it says BFF. Oh, how cute. And it's one of those. So I'll put $2 on that. I won't put that in with the bundle, but look, these are nice. Those two go together. This one did not stick to the magnet, but I don't think it's... I'll put that like that. Stop it. Stop it. Jamin. Industrial magnets. There's that. Gosh. That thing is heavy. Okay. We'll do this. So we've got us. Let's see. Do we have any more? That's not a bangle. That's a bracelet. Let's see. Ooh, that's pretty. That's a stretch. Yeah, I think that's it as far as bangles. Okay, so what about this? Okay, but I'll sell that separately. So we have this little group of silver bangles. These are cute. Put them like that. Isn't that pretty? So I'll sell this set of bangles for two. Hopefully they'll be okay. So that'll be $2. And for the gold ones, we'll do the same. Let's see. Come here, dude. Okay. But we'll do a dollar on these. There's not very many. Those there. So we'll do a dollar on those. Okay. Two and one. And this one's pretty. This is really pretty. And it's bigger. I like that. So we'll put three on that. That's super nice. And it does, it does have give. That's nice. That is beautiful. Oh, this is so pretty. This is a P. Oh, this is so pretty. Mm. For Pam or Patricia, if I can fix it, I don't think I can. Hold on, I got to get it. No, come on, come on, dude. Oh, done. Do we have got to get this on? Anyway, I'm not gonna stress it. Isn't that beautiful with the filigree P? And it just goes on, and it clasps really easy, but my nails will flip off if I'm not careful. Isn't that pretty? So we'll put three on that. I like that. And it's not anything too special, but it's pretty. Okay, we have... Hmm. This is... Looks like Premier Design. Is this Premier Design? Yes, it is. Okay. So we have Premier Design with the clear, the white, almost a cat's eye look to it. That's got a little, I don't know, if that's supposed to be like that or not. Anyway, you've got this beautiful enhancer here that comes off. I'm not sure about these silver beads, if they're supposed to have that gold to it. I can't tell. Hmm. Anyway, let's just put this into crafts. It's got some beautiful beads. This will go into the bead craft lot. 
And if anybody's interested in it, I'll do a dollar. But that'll have to go in with the bead lot. I can't sell anything like that because it's too messed up. Okay, this is an older one. This has some great big beads on it. It's kind of cute. So this will be $2. This is probably very vintage. Look at that. And some people like stuff like this. One of the Flintstones wives lost their necklace. And I have it right here. But that is cute. And they're in good shape. Yep. Okay. Like I said, I didn't get any of those earrings. And just Oh, here's a pair. Let me hush. Ooh, these are pretty. These are like, um, what are they called? Uh, opalescent glass and silver. Uh, I don't think these say anything. Hold on here. No, I don't see anything. These are really, really pretty. Kind of filigree on the back. I'm going to put four on these. These are pretty. I like them. I like them, like them. Oh, we did find one. That's real pretty. So, I'll put $3 on these. These are cool. What did I put on? Those can go over here. The single ear, these will go over here. The single earrings will go into my pile. I don't see any more. I hate that Rivoli is not here. Dang, going it. Man, what is going on? People eat them? Okay, this is bent. It's got some bins in it, so that'll go into crafts. This is cute. So I crocheted this with wires, an angel pin. That is $2. Okay, that's a pretty earring too, but of course there's no mate. That's a pretty earring. Oh, look at that. Isn't that cute? No mate. Oh, this is wild and wacky. These feel like rubber. These are gross. Wow. Fluorescent. Those look like something you could use to fish with. That would be going into crafts unless somebody wants it. It's a dollar and it's rubber and it feels yucky. Poo. Oh, these are cute. These are some nice blue beads with the gold tone in between. We have a nice vintage clasp and it seems to work. These are graduated from small to bigger, but not too big. These are kind of cool. We do have a discoloration right here. So I'm going to go ahead and put these into crafts. But they would be a dollar if anybody's interested. I hate that. I hate it when it's really something cute. This is pretty. I'm hoping this is all in one piece. This is real pretty. Okay, this is a quadruple strand. <laughs> this is real pretty. These have like really pretty turquoise blue stations. And then we have, wow. I'll, I'll just show it to you. This is real pretty. Look at that. Cat's eye beads. And these little stations here are the turquoise. Look at that. This is nice, 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 nice. Okay, I'm going to spread it out like this. Look at that. Let me move some of this stuff so I can show it to you. Get away. Right down here. Oh, yeah, I like that. Isn't that gorgeous? So I'm put five dollars on this one without the uh, single earrings attached. Come on, single earrings attached. We don't need those. Yeah, these are pretty. Okay, very nice. These 
Oh, that's pretty too. Isn't that pretty? I think that has a mark on it, but it might not be anything. Meh. Okay, that's got nothing that's broken. That's just a little bead. Here's a ghosty woasty. This will go into it's faded. We'll go into a crowd. Um, oh, that's kind of cute. They pop these together. Are they in good shape? I'll be danged. I don't believe it. Yes. We got a pair. These are cute. These have two little rhinestones. There is a leaf behind it and then a, like a little flower that comes up here. You see the rhinestones? Look at those. Those are gorgeous. I don't think they're marked. Um, very pretty. Let me check and make sure. No, these need cleaned. No, no marking. These are pretty, though. So, I'll put $3 on these. These are really pretty. I'll make sure they're clean if I sell them. Okay, I do see a ghosty. So, we have a pair of ghosts, and these are cute because they're fat and they're hefty. So, we'll put three on those. That's a real cute. They look like something from the Hallmark store. Oh, this is this is so cute. Now I know a lot of people don't like wood and all that stuff, but these are cute. This is coconut shell, heart, and discs. And this is Starling, so I'll put three dollars on this. That is really pretty. I like the way it looks. Nice for the spring and summer. Feels good, it's lightweight, it's wonderful. You guys are almost done. Ooh, this is pretty. Oh my gosh, this is really pretty. Who is this? Wait a minute. Okay, this does not have a maker's mark, but let me look down here. Let me lay this out. This is gorgeous. Wait a minute. This is gorgeous. Look on the back of this. It says happiness. I don't... If this was a Brighton, it would be marked, but it is just so pretty. Wow. It's got the little... Yeah, that's really pretty. And then it says... It, this, this is gold and silver. It says you're... Friendship means the world to me. That is so cute. Look at that. Come on, turn over. Oh, that is so cute. This heart is beautiful. So we got silver with the gold. And then silver with the silver. And that's kind of a bronze. It lays like that. And then the happiness is on this side. Can you see the colors? Isn't that pretty? And it's super long. And then you've got that there that comes down. That's like a little charm. It's like a little Rivoli crystal. Wow. I like this. Okay. No markings or anything. So, I'm, But I'm going to put six on this. This is super long and super cute. See how long it is? Isn't that nice? Super long and super cute. Okay, we're almost done. All the littles fell to the bottom. The littles and the thins. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there, guys. We are getting there. I don't see any matches to my earring. That's so upsetting. Okay, then we got this and this. Okay, so the earrings, this one, I don't know if that's 
over? Probably not. Okay, there's that little one. No maker mark. I mean, no. That's a Santa. I didn't find the other one. That's a cute little ring. But that'll go into crafts. It's so tiny. This is really pretty. There's no maker on it. That looks like my grandmother's. That's something. This is pretty. But it's not anything, you know, sterling or anything. It's just, what's this say? I don't know what that means. I-B-B-C-N. Don't have a clue. And it's icky, so it's going in the trash bag. Okay, I don't see anything else in there. Um, this was interesting. This is a single earring. I think. Anyway. These are cute. These are pink. It's a real pale lipstick pink. Caught on a ring. Let's see if we go that way. These are cute. I like these. These are little screw backs. Aren't those cute? Wow. So I'll put $2 on those. Those might be, I don't know if those would be Bakelite or not. Those are cute. I have no idea, but they are pretty. Then we have a little pink. Looks like a, I don't know what that is. I'm going to put it into crafts, but it's a dollar if anybody wants it. I think it's a dyed agate. It's kind of like that. And that's over there. That has to go. It's really bad. Now this is pretty. This is um, nothing. It's I mean, it's no make or mark. This is beautiful. Get away, get away. You see how beautiful that silver is? It's like a glitter silver. It's just beautiful. And it comes up. You have the little, and then the bigger, and then the biggest. This is really pretty. So I'm going to put $4 on that. The silver tone is perfect. Yeah, that's really pretty. Okay, then we have... That chevron and it is a little bit messed up so we'll do craft pile for a dollar now these are just sitting together huh <laughs> that'll never happen again these are pretty those are kind of a blue yeah almost a almost a cobalt blue kind of pretty and gold tone I don't see a marking, but boy, those are nice. Let's put three on those. Those are pierced. This doesn't have a, unfortunately. This is pretty. This is just a beautiful little pin. I think it's vintage. I love it. It's just darling. Look at this. It's like, it's like glass with like a mirrored back. Yeah, that's really pretty. It's almost like the Peter Max style, you know. It's just got a lot of character. So I'll put three dollars on that. That's beautiful. Okay. Next is a beautiful, is that a stretch? Yeah. This is gorgeous. This has got quite a bit of stretch in it. You have a kind of a maroon, an off green, a, and an orange, and a brown. Let me look on the inside, see if we have a mark. No, nope, but boy, this has some good stretch. This is pretty. Let me put it on for you. Look at that. Don't you guys like that? That is neat. There's the brown, the maroon, or 
there's the yellow, kind of orangish yellow, kind of green. That's pretty. So let's put $3 on that stretchy. That's gorgeous. Okay, we've got glass. And we've got a toggle. Looks like somebody made this. But it's kind of cute. I can't tell how big it is. Hold on here. Okay. No, it's big enough for me. It's got some beautiful beads. It's got some lamb pork beads here. Look at these. These are pretty. So let's put $3 on it. It's not very big. But it's very pretty. Purples. Purple glass. Very nice. Okay, that's just a band. Put that into crafts. That's an earring by itself. Oh, we got another pair. Wow. This little bead pair for a dollar. Aren't those cute? Just a dollar. This is kind of cute, but it's very worn. No, it's not that worn. Hmm. It's not bad at all, really. Okay. It's just got that little orange plastic stone in it. For all my little ring lovers. I've got a few that just love rings. And they don't care if they're plastic or not. This is actually a six. Just barely a six. So we'll do two dollars on that. That's so cute. Okay. Oh man. We only have the one feather. Then we only have one of those. We only have one of that's a little pink elephant, which people probably saw yesterday after their green deer. Ooh, these now these are pretty. And these are actually have a pair. It's a miracle. No, these are neat. Aren't those pretty? The gold tone is fabulous. These are brand spanking new. I like these. Kind of an amber color. And gold tone, so I'll do four on these. Very pretty. And they're kind of uh, plastic, but they're almost heavy enough for glass. They are just really, really pretty. Pretty, pretty. Okay, we don't have the, the other one for this. And we have a, a ring, but it's seen better days, I do believe. I don't know, though. I don't think that that's sterling or anything. Um, it's not bad looking. Let me look. No, I don't think so. I don't think it's anything. I don't think it's 925. Don't believe. Well, my goodness, I thought it said something, but I don't see it. Must be seeing things. Okay. Mm. No, but it is cute. It is a size about seven and a quarter. And it is like a double chevron. That is cute. So I just put two dollars on it. Doesn't have hardly any wear at all. There it is. Pretty. Two dollars, seven and a quarter. And I don't think I have a match for anything else. Nope. Wow, I'm disappointed. That's cute. That's definitely 70s. <sighs> and then there's that. And then there's this. Okay, that would have been good for yesterday. Could have blinged yourself out with some green. Wow. It is very 
faded. Be a fun ring for a little girl though to play with. So I'll just put a dollar on it. Some I want it for the grandchild, granddaughter to play with, or this is what's kind of got wear on it. It's kind of cute though. Okay, guys. Hey, we're done. That is it. Except for one silver hoop that doesn't have a match. Remember, that was the real heavy one. Well, I'm disappointed. But I'll keep the, you know, the single earrings and see if we get any matches in the other box. But I don't see people getting matches very often. We'll go back through and see if any of these are silver. You know what I mean? Just to, you know. If you guys don't do anything else but leave it as silver scrap, that's a little bit of money in your pocket if you find stuff. So, all right, guys. Well, I'm going to get off here. We do have the other box, but I think I'm going to wait on it for a minute. Um, we can put it up for a while. And then I have um, some stone that I want to show, some stone jewelry. And I've got some other things coming. So I'm very excited, and I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And my next giveaway will be at 400. It's going to be a while, um, and I'll show you what it is. Since I had it out for the other day to show you, you've got it is a jewelry box, and these are just little cabochons. I think they're just plastic. And um, inside is three little pieces of jade, little hearts, the purple, the green, and I think that this is actually red jasper. But that's what will come in this little box, just to show my appreciation and to show you that um, I like to share with my subs. Um, I hope you guys will subscribe to my channel. You guys know it's free. It doesn't cost anything. You just will go right down. Let's see. It would be right here. Let's see. Right there. And right beside that little area where it says subscribe is a bell. If you hit that bell, then you will be notified when my next video is coming on. And um, it's not like it's going to give you an email or anything like that. It's not going to bug you like that. It doesn't make a noise. Um, it just comes up in your, you know, with your other things that you're subscribed to uh, if you've hit the bell. And um, I usually want subscribers to do the giveaways only. Um, but... I have some people that I'm sure probably haven't subscribed yet, and they are avid watchers, and they are also people that do purchase for me. So I'm hoping that everybody that watches a lot and purchases for me is a subscriber. But if you're not, you're always welcome to my channel. It you know, it's not a must that you must subscribe. Um, but when I get up there, probably past five hundred seven fifty. It'll probably be to where only a subscriber can win my giveaways. And um, so just remember, it costs nothing. It helps me out. Um, when you push the thumbs up, it does wonders for my channel. Um, when you watch a video, if you forget to do it as you're first coming in to watch, you can do it right when you're finished. You can go back and do it. Um like me, I'll watch my own video and forget. So I know it's not hard to forget, but um, remember, it helps me out quite a bit. So you guys have a wonderful weekend. My grandbaby's doing wonderful. When Chanel gives me permission, I'll put a picture up. And um, the dogs aren't in here tonight. Yay! They're in the kitchen chilling out. And... Um, they're doing real well with the baby, so we don't have to worry about them. And um, to all my friends and family, my subscribers that are my friends and family, um, I just wish you the best. Stay healthy, and we will see you here probably tomorrow. Thanks again for watching, you guys.
Have a great weekend.